Welcome to my channel, guys. Today we're going to be making some fried whiting. I've got one pound of whiting here. That amounts to seven fillets. I got two eggs beaten, and I've got a mixture of Old Bay jerk seasoning, onion and garlic powder, and adobo. And I also have a cup of corn flour. Tap on the description box and the exact measurements for each whiting fish is listed there, okay? So the first thing we're going to do is coat all of our whiting fish in seasoning. So I'm just massaging all of the seasonings into it. This is super easy and fast. You should be done in about 10 to 15 minutes because whiting is a very thin and flaky fish, so it doesn't take long to season at all. So I have my pot here. I'm just going to pour my oil. This is about is about half a cup of oil and we're going to let our oil heat up for about five minutes before we start adding the fish so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to take our fish we're going to coat it in egg make sure you coat it really well let it drip down and then coat it in your corn flour. Make sure you get it everywhere. Okay, so after it's fully coated, we're going to go over to our frying pan and begin frying. And we're just going to continue to repeat the steps. Coat it in egg. And I've got my fire on a medium heat because we don't want this to burn. But this is whiting fish and it cooks very quickly because the fish is so thin and flaky. So we're probably going to just fry this for about maybe five minutes on each side for a total of 10 minutes and it should be good to go. So it's been about five minutes now. Our bottom is brown and I make sure I use some cooking tongs so that I'm not using a fork and piercing the fish. So we're just gonna flip it over. Okay, so these are about done now. I'm going to take this out and drain it on a paper towel. So here we have our fried whiting. See how nice and golden? It is. I don't want to touch it because it's still hot. It's nice and crispy, as you could see. Ooh, hot. And it smells amazing. I can't wait to tear it open. You know when you tear it open and it's white and flaky on the inside? Yes. Now I'm just going to open it up. You see how nice and flaky it is on the inside? 
It tastes good, right? So here's our finished product. Here is our whiting. I just garnished it with some Scotch bonnet peppers. It's purely for decoration.